So the deli has been around about 28 years now. Uh, we kind of are a delicatessen where we sell the retail meats and cheeses to go. Uh, we also have a sandwich line, so you walk in and we have made-to-order sandwiches with double-baked uh, bread from the bakehouse uh, and all fresh ingredients. We don't pre-slice anything, we do it all to order. Um, we have a little coffee shop next door, so we sell cakes and espresso drinks and pies and things. Um, but the deli has kind of become an institution. You know, it's a place that everybody brings their family when they're in town. Uh, so our sales are kind of split up between just the sandwich line sales and people coming in and buying sandwiches and then a, about a third of the business is the retail sales and then about a quarter of the business is basically taking catering events. Uh, we do weddings and bar mitzvahs and drop off stuff to offices. Our biggest business is always at lunch. You know, we often have a line that's going out the door. We're actually in the process of working through doing an addition right now. Uh, so we've been working on a plan for a few years as far as what is, we can build on this site and how it all fits in with zoning and with the historic district. Uh, and we're hoping that we can actually start doing some demolition this fall and start building next year, which will be very exciting. Last year, and it had been one of the things I'd wanted to do for a long time, and it just, you know, there's struggles about finding the right people to do things and finding the time to do it, was adding an edible landscape out front. So I don't know if you noticed out front of the next door, but we've always had some beds out there, and they were okay, there was some stuff planted, but we really wanted to grow things that you could eat. So a woman came to work for us who has a master's degree in horticulture, I think, uh, and she basically said, I know I will design that and plan that if you can give me the time and the schedule to do it. So we did that. Uh, and it's been amazing because we planted it and we put signs out from what all the products are and we're picking the flowers to garnish catering trays or the herbs to use in the salad case. But more than anything else, that has added a service component that I never thought it would. Everyone who walks by stops and looks at it and comments on it and reads the sign about how to use something or reaches down and touches some of the herbs and smells their hands. And it's been really fun to see how it brings like different generations of people. So you have like the grandmother and the grandson here and you know there's always that awkwardness sometimes of them going around and shopping together and that like brings them together and they're looking at the plants and they're talking about them. It's been really fun and the investment was nothing compared to the service we've gotten back from it. It's been very cool.